this video I'm making some shelving for an alcove on the side of a chimney breast in my house. The alcove has a radiator in it and I wanted to direct the heat into the room and not have it just absorb into the new shelving. I bought a sheet of softwood plywood and had the shop cut it down to the sizes I needed for the project. My intention was to direct the heat from the radiator into the room by having the bottom of the shelving at a 45 degree angle. I start by laying out onto a side piece where the bottom of the shelving would be and then clamped both of the side pieces together to cut the 45 degree angle so that there is a reference edge for the bottom piece of the shelving and to achieve a better aesthetic. I then laid out onto a side piece where the shelves will be positioned and where I'll need to drill the holes for screws. I countersunk the holes and countersunk the other side as well to provide a little clearance so that the joints could come together very tight. I didn't have the bottom piece cut at the shop and instead used some leftover from a previous project. I cut this to size using my circular saw and cut the piece at a 45 degree angle along the long sides. Here I'm marking out where I'll need to pre-drill holes in the shelves and then drilling them. Once the pieces had all been prepared it was fairly simple to put the overall unit together. I propped the unit with some scraps whilst fitting the bottom angled piece as this was a little trickier to hold in place. I gave all of the cut edges a quick sand with my random orbital sander with a 120 grit disc. I felt that this piece didn't need a finish or much protection as it will mainly be used for books. I also sanded off the sticker that came with the wood from the shop. I gave it a final sanding afterwards with a 240 grit disc. The alcove where I will install the shelving is slightly coved in the corners from years of paint buildup, so I cut a small chamfer on the back of the shelving to provide clearance for this. I fixed the shelving into the alcove using three screws on either side going from the inside face of the plywood into the masonry walls with wall plugs.
Lifting the shelving into position proved a challenge and I ended up using two folding chairs to temporarily prop it. This shelving is very sturdy and fits nicely into the space and when the heating is on, the bottom piece does do its job of directing the heat away from the shelving and into the room. If heat going up into the shelving is a major concern, you could also fill the wedge at the bottom of the unit with insulation. Oh, 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 o